What's up, everybody? Just thought I'd go ahead and do a live stream since I haven't in a while. Uh, answer some of you guys' questions or anything, so let's get started. If you guys have any questions, just go ahead and ask them. What's up, Michelle? What's up, Ethan? What's up, Michaela or Nicholas? Oh, there's so many comments. I'm doing well, thank you. Doing pretty well. Just uh, been busy with work. I've actually been getting some uh, dental work done as well. Have a new setup. I'll show you guys in a second. Um, haven't really played trumpet much lately, but I've been getting back into it slowly. Let's see here. Okay, I can't read that fast. Maybe I'll pull it up on my laptop here. One second. So I can read some of them. Going to my own live stream. Let's see. All right, let's see. Were you ever in advanced classes, like uh, English and stuff, or what, what do you mean by that? Uh, where did you march? I marched Carolina Crown and I marched Academy. Did I just wake up? No, I did not just wake up. I woke up around six o'clock in the morning. Uh, I met your girlfriend at the Phoenix airport and I was leaving for my Academy Calbeck camp. That's awesome. She told me a couple people came up to her. What's my highest solid note? Probably a double A, honestly. How do you lip troll? Um, depends, I guess. Um, one second, computer's freaking out over here. All right, so I guess it depends. Um, I usually just work on lip slurs. I work on lip slurs and I go from there. I feel like the live stream was interrupted, so I'm gonna wait a second. Let's see. I am not going to night beat, no. I'm gonna try to go to San Antonio and I'm gonna try to go to finals, but depending on school and all that, that's that's how everything else is gonna work out. Um, what trumpet do I got on my mouthpiece? Okay, so I have the Black Artisan um, AB190S. It's a very nice horn. It's more of a classical horn than a uh, lead horn, I would say, just the way it sounds. It's very fat, very dark. And the mouthpiece that I just started playing on was is the uh, Monet uh, B2S3. This is very, very, very deep. I don't know if you guys can see, I don't think it'll focus, but it's very deep. Um, but it gives me a better tone. Um, accuracy on the notes are better. Um, of course, it is hard to play higher on there, but overall, a better mouthpiece than what I've had before. My favorite color is probably blue, yeah. I marched Crown 16, yes. Play the lowest note I can. I guess that's, a low, that's not the lowest note, I don't think. I guess, I guess low F sharp is the lowest one. You keep asking me the same question, were you ever in uh, advanced classes? Zelda, yes. I have so many things that I've written down, guys, that I need to do. Um, I just haven't got the time to do it. Uh, it's busy with work, um, planning on merch and stuff. So if you guys haven't checked out the merch, go check it out. Um, I'll leave a link down in the description for that. Uh, Pre-ordering stops on the 30th, I believe. So make sure to pre-order. I will be not, I will, yeah, I won't be doing um, orders after it. Just because it costs me more money to make the shirts than the money that I will have to buy their shirts. So uh, that's why we order in bulks. So if you're not having pre-ordered yours, make sure to do that. Let's see here. Play the highest note you can. I can't play high on this mouthpiece. this mouthpiece and 
I'm too lazy to go get my other one. Um, but it's a very deep mouthpiece. Let's see here. Any tips on lead trumpet playing? Um, just, I honestly, I people don't believe me for whatever reason. But I honestly, the only things that I ever worked on were lip slurs and long tones. That is it. Uh, that's all I needed. It might not work for you guys. I would try it. Just give it a try um, and go from there. And honestly, you just have to mess around up there. Uh, you can't just, um, you know, hope that one day you'll be able to play high. You, you got to play high to play high, if that makes sense. Second favorite instrument. I would say either the cello or the French horn. I would play either of those instruments if I didn't play the trumpet. What do I do for fun? Um, well, I work a lot, so I don't really have time to do it much, but um, I like to go to the movies, and I like to hang out with my friends, uh, with my girlfriend. Um, that's pretty much it, honestly. Don't do much. I do know uh, Lucky Chops, yes. Can I meet you in San Antonio, DCI? I, I probably have a meet, um, like a meetup for everybody. Uh, whoever's wearing, like, I'll give, like, away a shirt or something like that. So stay tuned for that. How was Bog 3C? Um, I still have it. It's less deep, obviously, than the B2S3 that I'm playing on right now. But, um, I think that the Monet's better. Just because, like I said, it increases my accuracy and it's just... So many questions, I can't keep up, guys. What lead mouthpiece do, do I use? Um, I use a Bob Reese Sport 2SV. What was your highest note in the sixth grade? I don't even know. I don't even know if high notes existed. So to be honest, probably not very high. I think I hit at like a high C in seventh grade and that was like one sentence. That's when I started getting obsessed with high notes, honestly. Bob 42SV. Paul, you're such a troll, dude. I'm not minoring in anything. I'm actually studying nursing. So I started nursing school on May 7th. I've never heard of Op Dog. Pineapple on pizza? Yes. <laughs> I love pineapple pizza. Do I take lessons? No, I actually took lessons maybe for a semester um, in my college year. Uh, my first college year, I think. Um, that's about it. Other than that, I just learned by listening and just playing regularly. I like Wayne better than Maynard, honestly. I think Wayne just sounds so much better and so much, so much broader and nicer. Favorite composer, Hans Zimmer. I've been to Hawaii, yes. I went to Honolulu with the band trip uh, in my high school year, my senior year. When is the next video? I'm actually gonna be working on a video today um, and hopefully post it by Tuesday or something like that. Tuesday, Wednesday, just turn on the po uh, post notifications. So click on that bell on my channel and you'll never have to wonder again. I actually have a lot of mouthpieces here. I don't know what this one is. Um, this one says, I honestly can't even read this one, but I don't, I don't even think it's a trumpet mouthpiece. Like, if you look at it, compared to a real trumpet mouthpiece, like, I don't know what it is. So if anybody knows what this is, it won't really focus, but, um, don't know, let me know. And then this one is the first mouthpiece that I ever got, that I came with my trumpet, actually. Uh, I got my first trumpet in Mexico, so not a good idea, don't do that. <laughs> Especially because it was a brand that I've never heard of. Obviously, it was like in sixth grade, so I didn't really know what, you know, brands were good or anything like that. But this one doesn't even have a marking on it. It's an unknown um, brand, an unknown size. Yeah, it looks all tarnished. Then I have this one. It's all tarnished as well. Obviously, I don't use these. That's kind of gross. This is 7C. Um... I don't know how I feel about it. I haven't played it in a while, so I guess I'll clean them up and see see what I what I think. This is the first Bach 3C I've ever gotten. It's a Benson Bach 3C. All the silver came off, um, and I played on this till probably till Crown, so 2016. So from seventh grade, which was 2007 to 2016, 
this is what I played on. A Benson Block 3C. And as you can see, all the silver is gone. Uh, they were worried about brass poisoning. Never happened. Who knows? Uh, it has to taste a little weird, so I don't play on it anymore. I actually got a new Block 3C. Um, but then I lost it, so I don't know. <laughs> I currently use the, the Monet, like I said. And then this one, it's another 7C that came with the uh, pocket trumpet. I'm teaching my sister, my little sister, how to play trumpet. Um, hopefully, if you get time, um, she'll be better than I am. Let's see here. If I've ever gone through an armature change, no, actually, I've always played on this side. And you can even tell, like, from the lighting, you can see the line right here. Um, it feels weird. Honestly, if I put it right in the middle, it feels like I'm looking that way. Like, I feel like my whole head is just that way. But if I put it here, it, feel like, it feels like I'm looking straight. Um, so I'll show you where I play. I play right here. So a little, a little off center, not too bad. I mean, the tire, the tire, the most tire I get, the uh, farther it goes, but um, for the most part, I play right here. Right here, not here, not here. Um, but yeah, let's see here. What other questions we got? Why is everyone doing this? Doing what exactly? Can I double tongue? Ah, uh, not very good. But yeah. Honestly, I need to pull out really bad. expect in your first year of DCI honestly it depends where you're marching but you just got to be ready to work hard uh, put in the work and it's definitely gonna be warm and you're definitely gonna be tired so uh, keep your head up keep working hard and you'll get the results you want make the sound of your favorite animal <laughs> I honestly uh, I don't know I don't even know what my favorite animal is I might oh how old are you I'm 23 turning 24 in uh, October can I do fly the bumblebee? No, I cannot. Um, maybe if I practice a lot and I uh, put my mind to it, probably. Is cereal soup though? I don't know. I just had cereal and I actually didn't even have it with milk. I had it with uh, yogurt. Uh, pineapple and coconut yogurt. I've never played fiction in the exhibition now. What is the slowest thing I can play? I, what is that? question even mean I'm switching to metal phone any thoughts uh, don't sound like a trumpet honestly it's very I have a metal phone and it's honestly super hard to play just because the note accuracy is so different uh, the mouthpiece is, feels almost the same but just the uh, where the note slot is just it's kind of hard um, but yeah I, I feel like I sound more like a trumpet when I play loud and whatnot and it's kind of obnox obnoxious so how fast was my range developed? Honestly, it was within the past couple years. Like in 2015, there was this high F at the end of the opener for Academy Show, um, and nobody could play it, and I could barely hit it. Uh, but honestly, playing it all summer, the high F, is just kind of, that's when I started building my range. Just playing constant high F at the end of the opener. <laughs> range exercises, go check out my latest, latest video, or two videos ago, I think it is. Um, I did a uh, YouTube video on exercises and lip slurs and things that I do to build my range. Can you cook like Chef Ramsay? No, I cannot. If I can cook like uh, cook like Chef Ramsay, I'd probably be a cook or a chef. I don't know. You should try the triple tongue. Okay. So for triple tongue, a crown we did. Dagger, da, dagger, da, dagger, da, da, and I was terrible at it. I'm still terrible at it, but I'll just give you guys an example, I guess.
For you, what's the hardest part of playing Melo aside from the pitcher's shoes? Honestly, that's it. Everything else is fine. It's just finding the right pitch, which is basically the whole point of the horn. <laughs> so, what kind of valve oil do I use? I use a headman. Let's see if I can bring it for a back. Headman. This is what I use for my slides. This is what I use for my uh, valve oil and. Um, it's very nice. It's kind of expensive, I think. Honestly, thinking about it, probably not. It's like six dollars, maybe, just for a bottle like this, and it lasts pretty long because it's very good. So, credit card number. Yikes. Probably not. Favorite course other than the ones you march? Um, probably Phantom Rangerman. Uh, back in the olden days. So Cavalier is the same. Chromatic scale? Okay. <laughs> Guys, if you missed something, <laughs> just... <laughs> Just rewind. I don't know if you can rewind during the live stream, but I think after the live stream, it'll be posted and uh, you can go whenever you want. Um, let's see. Thank you. I feel so weird looking at the uh, screen like that. All right. So, like I said, I play on a Monet uh, B2 is three for regular playing, or I've been trying to. It's kind of hard, but it's fine. Gotta get used to it. And for lead playing, I play on a Bob Reeves 42 SV. Uh, as you can see, ooh, I almost dropped that. The difference is pretty, pretty noticeable. Like that's just super deep. Uh, and this one's like, <laughs> it's like right there compared to this one. I could put like half of my fingertip in there. So yes, it is easier to play on this one. High notes at least. basically a high F, no warm up. Like I said, it's very easy to play on this one. Uh, can I play piccolo trumpet? I don't have a piccolo trumpet, so if you wanna, you know, wanna buy me one, go for it. Give us a hair tutorial. Um, actually, I just got a haircut um, yesterday. Looks okay, I think. Matches my shirt. See, see, go check out the shirts. I'll leave a uh, link down in the description. Like I said, I'm ordering those in bulk, so after this, um, order goes through, I'm not gonna have a shirt for a little while. So make sure you get your order in. Uh, I think they're about $20 each plus shipping, which is kind of, you know, pretty expensive, I would say. But um, I have a uh, coupon code for you guys. It's DCI Attic 10. Uh, so make sure to enter that in the checkout. And I'll give you 10% um, off the shirts. Favorite cover to play? Well, well okay, there's so many. Uh, so they keep asking me if I can play piccolo trumpet. I can't play piccolo trumpet. I don't even have a piccolo trumpet. Um, can you do more transcriptions? Like, let it go in front like me. I could. It just it takes me a little while, guys. There's a lot of stuff that I want to get done. And honestly, I really like doing the uh, multi-tracks better than I like to do the solos. Do you like the Beatles? I'm um, sure. <laughs> What was the mouthpiece you did high F? Uh, it's a Bob Reeves 42 SV. That looks so weird when I play. Like my face just goes. tell I kind of suck right now I've been playing like a couple weeks let's see what's your next cover song I'm gonna be doing actually part of the show that I march I'm working on Carolina Crown 2016 
and it's gonna be the opener. I'm gonna try to sing the beginning part, uh, but we'll see how good I am at singing at that point, I guess. Let's see here. Hello, Gilbert. Bumblebee, Bumblebee. Nice forehead, you're right, I get it. Pretty solid forehead. Oh my goodness, there's so many things coming in here. Oh. <laughs> do a cover, I don't even practice that much to do that cover. Anyway guys, um, I don't see any very, very, very many um, serious questions here. So I'm gonna have to start working on this tune uh, for you guys, hopefully Tuesday or Wednesday I'll post it. Um, actual, and then the shirts, make sure to check out the link. I'll leave a link down in the description for you guys. Um, I think it's dciaddict.axamo.com. Um, it would be great to have your support by one of the shirts. There's also some other designs you can pick from. There's some hats, there's some backpacks. Uh, so definitely go check it out and put in your order before the 30th. Uh, okay, what is the important question? Okay, nobody's asking the important question. Perfect, all right. I'll see you guys later. Uh, make sure to like, share, subscribe, comment, share, all those things. Go check out the website. Love you guys. Thank you.